make the bot booth. And this is a fairly large life size helmet. And stand. Something a little like sexy, fancy, newest, cutting edge. This has a camera built in, so you're gonna be able to watch it print on your iPhone app. Like this has. This so when has, you're at work and you leave this home printing, you can check up on it. Exactly. See if it crashes. But would you do that? Would you leave it at home printing? I mean, yes. is there, there's no problem with it. Fire. <laughs> it's not gonna car start a fire. Your yeah, print. Okay. And well, this one has the smart extruder, so this one um, will know if your filament has a twist in it and jam. Uh, It'll actually pause the print for you so you can fix the, the filament. Um, this one has assisted leveling, so there's only two leveling knobs. It's a glass. It's a glass built. It's a glass plate. This one has the glass plate that comes with it. Versa acrylic. The glass build plate is fantastic. I'm a huge fan. I borrowed I one for my Rep 2 in the office. Why? Because it does not deform. It does not warp. Once you level it, it will stay leveled and you will just get... I wish... These are mostly my prints, but they stuck them all in glass and I'm very annoyed. <laughs> I keep wanting to be like, I want to show you this. Because people want to walk away with them, right? I know, they do walk away. Wait, oh, I wonder if my gear heart is still good. My gear heart is still good. Good, yes, yes. Just keeping an eye on that. Do you I have, have anything that I can take with me? Um, the nuts and bolts. Oh, okay, good. Okay. Nice. Are we out? No. Please don't be out. Please don't be out. I brought like 2,000. Oh, sweet. Oh, I love it. I knew that if I kept asking this question, somebody, somebody would, would let me take something with me. <laughs> For the boys. Starting at 48. Did he say how much these were? This one's about $28.99. $28.99. And how many extruders? It's just one. It's just one? Oh, okay. But it is kind of awesome, huh? Is this the... So, it's an experimental printer. Uh, the ABS printer is expanded build chamber. It's enclosed. Because when you're printing super large objects, yeah. you want it to cool at the same time, so it stays warm the whole time. So the shrinkage that I had could just be the change in temperature. Yeah, huh? what, what printer were you using? This, this is kind of what we're okay. focused on education. We don't want little kids to put their hands up. Oh, what do these run? 1375. 1375. So it's not a heated bed. And the chamber. It's a 4x4x5 four by four by inch build plate. Mm -hmm. so it's small. You're going to get very little shrinkage. Oh, okay. And what about your scanner? Where's the scanner? We don't have it here, actually. Um, it's not just for us. It's for it's an SCL file, so. Anywhere. It's not for us. So we don't want to make anything super proprietary, I guess. It pauses the print for you, it sends a notification to your desktop, your iPhone, whatever you select. So if you go to the store, you can see what happens. You, you can go on your phone yeah, remotely and see. It has a camera it on board and all about the fifth filament. generation printers. So you never lose prints anymore, it just pauses it for you. What's that? Okay. But now you get an alert. So it gives you an alert because there's, there's a sensor. There's a sensor in the extruder and then it's linked into the, the new software. We have, it's called, it's now it's called MakerWare, the new software is MakerBot Desktop. Okay. It's very similar. It's got a new, a couple of new upgrades, okay. but it's it's linked into the app. It's linked into the it's cloud enabled. These are all Wi-Fi enabled, um, USB, nice. Ethernet, camera, and it doesn't cancel the print yeah. when you have, have a jam, jam or anything. Yeah. So you can you can also pause it remotely if you want. Yeah. If, like you're looking at it, and you don't like your print. Yeah. You can cancel the print. You don't want to waste the so filament. Yeah. yeah. It's not because the print's bad. If you don't like it, you yeah. don't want to waste filament. Right, right, right. Which is cool. Testing it out. Cool. And is there post-production? Like, do you have an aspirin? No. With a PLA? Basically, you uh, pop it off. So in this one, so you'll be able to see. That's printing with a little support. You pull your support off. See the little line in the middle? Right. That's the support for the neck. Um, and that'll pop off. Yeah, that'll pop off. So I have a question. Were these uh, modifications in play when um, Stravis has bought Makerbot? So these were all in development then. Uh. So we really have no overlay. Um, and see the woman in the middle? Uh -huh. She's printed with support. Wow, that is a this lot. This is printed with what happened. Oh, okay. The percentage of overhang you can print without support. That's pretty impressive. So you just 
Yeah, push a button on the MakerBot software and it will add the supports in so you don't have to worry about designing it into your STL file. See, so that one over there is the one with the um, supports and then this is with the supports removed.